This is a daily news update. I'm Petty Officer Kat Smith, and these are your headlines from around the fleet. The Expeditionary Training Command was established April 13th in a ceremony at Naval Amphibious Base Little Creek. ETC's main function will be training foreign militaries in port security, non-commissioned officer professional development, maintenance management, control craft operation, and operational risk management. The new command will contribute to the Chief of Naval Operations 1000 Ship Navy Initiative. The first trilateral naval exercise was conducted between India, Japan, and the U.S. off the western coast of Japan. Trilat X-07 gave senior leaders, air and ship crews, a chance to work on interoperability between the three nations. Commander U.S. 7th Fleet Vice Admiral Doug Crowder said, he looks forward to further interaction between the Japanese Maritime Self-Defense Force and the Indian Navy. USS John C. Stennis completed operations with the French nuclear-powered aircraft carrier Charles de Gaulle. The two carriers provided support to the International Security Assistance Forces in Afghanistan, conducted bilateral exercises at sea, and personnel exchanges. Stennis will continue to operate in the Fifth Fleet Area of Operations in support of Operation Enduring Freedom. Also in the region, sailors and Marines from the 26th Marine Expeditionary Unit completed Exercise Eastern Maverick 2007 with Qatari forces. The bilateral military training included classroom training, practical applications, and live fire ranges. The exercise also strengthened military-to-military -military relationships and communication. For the Naval Media Center, I'm Petty Officer Kat Smith.